Ooh, nothing like a bike ride in the morning. Let's see what is happening at the office. Well, looks like there might be a customer issue with one of my accounts. I have to take a look at that. And, oh, looks like Mike may have gotten the analysis done for my meeting this afternoon with Acme Manufacturing. Need that to finish that deal. Let's see what else is happening. The service meeting I can sit in on, uh, forecast meeting. And let's take a look at what documents have been done. Oh, there's a PO and uh, looks like a new quote. You know, coming to work is always a joy when I have a digital workplace. Everything is at my fingertips and I can do anything from anywhere at any time. Having this intranet as part of Office 365 is great. I can find what's happening, the latest news, get to what I need to work on, and it really is designed to be really intuitive. Let's now go take a look at a couple of things here. Whoop, looks like the sales meeting's canceled today. And it'll give me some extra time. And uh, most importantly, you can see what other news is going on. Oh, look at down here. We're gonna be expanding to Hawaii. I see some vacations coming up mixed with work. And uh, let's also take a look at what Dilbert has to say today. Having these customs links is like having uh, my intranet right in front of me. I can get to whatever I need. Now let's take a look at industry news, see what's going on in uh, our world today. Oh, looks like uh, that's one of our competitors got that deal. Oh well, you can't win them all, but now that we have all the information in front of us, we're not going to have that happen as much. I'm going to also go check every day here. I check at the government RFPs that are put out there. Looks like there's some new buildings uh, being put up, and we may want to partner with those construction firms on putting solar on those buildings as part of the construction. I think I'll go check on the services here. I saw that there was a customer service issue with one of my customers uh, just after my run today, so I'm going to go drill into that just to make sure everything's okay. I have a uh, update meeting about that customer this morning, uh, the Cedarville Shopping Center. Uh, it looks like it's been completed. Ryan's been working on it, so uh, that shouldn't be an issue, but uh, we'll be sure to ask. I'm also going to go take a look at the project itself. It's great having everything in one place. I can go look at projects, account information, uh, anything else. And it looks like there is one outstanding issue about the helipad, and I can ask about that. In the okay, so now I'm going to go take a look, uh, go to my territory here, and... Uh, See what leads I've got, what calls I've got to do, and a few leads. Here's my contacts today, and I'll uh, go through those. Just, just take a look at my pipeline, review it. Uh, looks like everything is there. That looks good. Uh, oh, yeah, Summit. i got to go ahead and close that before uh, the end of the month. Um, looks like I've got that ACME meeting this afternoon, so I need to make sure I'm preparing for that. I saw that Mike got the analysis and we've got the proposal. I need to make a um, PowerPoint presentation for that as well this for this afternoon. Um, so I'm going to go in and let's take a look at where we're at on uh, those things. So yep, there's the analysis um, and there's what we need on that. Let's just see how the analysis came out. Okay, numbers look pretty good. Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty happy about that. I think this is something that's going to be a no-brainer for them. Okay, I'm also going to call Mike here if I can. I'll use Skype for business, which is awesome. I can do that right from here. And uh, see if there's any other things I need to know. Yeah, he wasn't there. So um, I'm going to go back and start on my sales presentation. And I think there is a template in sales documents here. And uh, I can go ahead and use that and start working on that. Okay, and I'll go ahead and download that and work on that. I think I've got a meeting coming up here. Uh, I think it was a team update meeting on the Cedarville project. Yep, here it is. I see my Skype for business call, and it looks like we've got the team online here. And uh, we're going to go ahead and discuss that project. Everything seems to be going well from what I saw, but I'll go ahead and let you guys go. Uh, my wife asked me to uh, ask for time off, reminded me. Now, one of the things I want to see if I can do is if I can actually mix work with time off. So in other words, if I work from home one a couple of the days, 
um, is that going to count as time off or can I do that? So I'm going to take a look at the time off policy. I'm going into our employee self-service area with our doc center and this is where I found our time off um, policy. It's great now that I can do that and not have to worry about um, looking and, and finding those policies. So next I'm going to go and see if anybody else is taking that time off. I'll go look at the time off calendar uh, which is part of again the employee self-service area and I'm going to go ahead and submit a leave request as well. Again, the employee self-service portal is awesome um, in that everything's there, whether I need to find documents, whether I um, need to uh, file expenses, ask for time off, or even link out to our ERP system. I can do that uh, from that, all a part of Office 365 and the internet portal structure. Okay, there we go. I'll submit that. That'll go in for approval and I can check the status of that uh, here in the self-service portal area. Now the other thing uh, I wanted to just check and make sure that the um, department got that. Here's my confirmation uh, email. All that's built into the system as well. And then finally, uh, I've been having problems with uh, a monitor, so I'm going to go into Help Central. And this is great because now I can go and get help from any department in a common way using a central help desk type of system. And so now I just go out, fill out uh, the help desk ticket and submit it and I know it's being worked on. I get updated on the status and it doesn't matter if it's IT, HR or what department it is, it's all done in a consistent way. No more kind of email chaos and wondering whether um, what I submitted or my request is being worked on. I can go spend time selling and not chasing down administrative type things. So here's uh, that put in and again just like the um, service process area there, process central, help central, I can check and see the status of any help desk request I've put in. And again it sends me a confirmation email and it'll also send me an alert email when it's been completed. Ah, here we are out at the cabin. It's awesome to be able to take a look at what's going on at the office from my phone or any device from anywhere. I can see that, oh, we got a PO in and a couple of quotes. Uh, I'm going to go in and check my uh, sales territory dashboard and see what leads have come in uh, and some of the traffic. Visit spmarketplace.com to learn how you can turn Office 365 into a digital workplace with SP Marketplace Digital Workplace Solutions. One platform, anywhere, anytime.